everybody, it's Bunny. So today I'm here to do my incredibly original Halloween, Halloween. <laughs> it's never not Halloween in my life. Um, ugh, look at that, lipstick all over my teeth. Everybody knows that's how we do it on the swamp. We just put lipstick all over everything, our teeth and our hands. So I swore by sun and moon and stars that I would have this video up yesterday because I was like, I'm gonna be the first. And then I ate like tons of cookies yesterday and I never eat sweet foods and all the sugar like congealed in my heart cavity. And on top of which, like, they put, they had, like, an Outer Limits marathon, um, like, the classic Outer Limits yesterday on the Chiller channel, and I came home and I started watching that, and I just passed out. I was like, aliens that look like raisins, and then it was just all over from there. And now I was, like, logging on today to the YouTube, and I was looking at my subscriptions box, and I think every single person I'm subscribed to has already done this video. So anywho's, I guess I'll just show you guys what I got right now. Oh, and um, so many people commented about my leggings last time. I'll just go ahead and tell y'all right off the dang bat instead of like going back and commenting to like everybody because there was probably like 30 people asking about these leggings that you saw in the background of my last video. Um, these are not black milk. Um, I've considered buying a product or several different products from Black Milk, but every single time I get to the checkout, I realize that their prices actually like are a Greek tragedy. Like they make angels weep. Like I just I cannot pay ninety eight dollars for some like polyester stretch leggings. I got these off of NastyGal.com. Um, I'm not affiliated with them, so before anybody is like, why are you doing it? You're a commercial. I got these from Nasty Gal. They were only like 56 bucks. They still have them as of like two days ago, which was the last time that I was kind of shopping on that site. And the brand of these is Idle Minds. Oh, uh, la 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 la. I got some stuff that's kind of pointless to show you guys. I got a new camera battery for my Sony NEX5, which is what I film for. So now I can like film more often. Um, and I got another larger memory card so I can film more without... It basically allows me to be lazy. It's kind of boring, right? That's like socks. I got this dress and this is from Nasty Gal. And this is called the Emmy dress, Emmy crochet dress, I think. They had it in black for a while, but oddly enough, I kind of wanted the cream one because I figured I could accessorize with black that way. So that's what the top of it looks like. It's just a lot of crocheted, um, like high neck collar. And then it's got like this, you know, section where you could put a belt and then kind of a long flowy dress. This is more for kind of when it warms up again though, because it is like a open back thing and then it has three button closure at the collar. Next thing I got is a another dress. I really love this. I'm kind of like wanting to do <clears throat> some 90s grunge looks lately. So I think this dress is like really like I don't know it's like if Kurt Cobain was alive and a woman this is what he would wear. This is a Ralph Lauren dress and it's like Ralph Lauren denim and supply. Basically like a maxi dress. How many times am I saying actually and basically in this video? It's a spaghetti strap dress and you know it's just a really 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 long maxi skirt dress. I can't even I'm gonna dangerously stand on the chair. So that, that does nothing. Um, it's just a really, really long, like to the floor length dress. The next thing I got is kind of similar. It's also from the same Ralph Lauren line. And this is a kind of grungy mixed fabric scarf, kind of similar textiles as the dress, but this also has like some wool pieces with heavy red stitching. I'm showing all the tag side just for maximum tackiness. So yeah, but this is like a really long scarf. It's a maxi scarf. Um, I don't know. I could like go like that. Ooh, I don't know. I could be like a, a rock dwelling nomad. You know what? I'm just going to show y'all like my really big gift now because I feel like the next 18 things that I would show y'all are like pertaining to that gift. So if I don't show you that gift, it's just going to be very confusing. I asked for another like camera that filmed in HD and filmed in good quality, good quality, but that was like a bit more portable because I'm always like so afraid to take my Sony NEX5 camera out of my house because I'm just totally convinced that it's going to get busted into a bajillion pieces. So 
I got the Sony, and I don't know what this is, Cybershot G. This is the one that I asked for because when I went to Best Buy, they told me that this was like a really good quality camera. And it actually will take photographs in 3D. I don't know why I'd ever want to do that but I could. Look, I can like be really weird and take a photo of a video. This corner is actually a flash that like <laughs> pops out, but I wanted to start doing more vlogs on my non-vlog channel. I don't have a vlog channel. I just have one channel. Um, but I wanted to start doing more vlogs and I feel like this is a camera, like since the lens closes up and everything, I feel like this is a camera that I can just like chunk in my purse and not really, you know, and then I can be like, what's up guys? And I can film more because everybody knows that this is like my number one hobby is making, making videos. This is the DSC-HX9V. Sounds like some kind of space equipment. Um, so yeah, this was like my big present. I should probably take this like <laughs> scarf off like that now. I got some presents that correlated with that. One is, and I really hope that this works, uh, this is a car mounting thing. And the uh, they told me at Best Buy that I could put this like for a camera. So this is the one that my parents got for me, but it goes in your vents instead of a suction cup because I've had a suction cup one in the past that I tried to film on my iPhone with, but it's always like shaking because like the windshield is vibrating. So I'm hoping this will provide a little bit better quality. Um, so it's just like a camera mount for my car. And the other thing I got is a monopod to like hold and then I can film and it's easier to film with. Um, and this actually has like an extendable arm so you can kind of do like wider range shots. It has like a little arm strap. So this is the Pocket X shot. I really like this for a monopod because normally monopods are like just as tall as a regular tripod and it's kind of impractical to like carry around in public because you just really look like so cool when you do that. Last camera related type thing is this really cool little device. It's a light, are y'all ready for special effects? It's like a LED spotlight type thing and it's magnetic and I figured I could hang this from my rear view mirror so if I ever want to film at night in my car I've got this little LED thing. I also feel like I could like affix this to a hat and like go to the swamp with it alligators. Isn't this so cute? My mom put this like bug in my stocking. She's like, you need a Christmas bug. This little guy was in my stocking and he's actually like a little um, zipper pouch. So I got some Christmas cash and I got a Chick-fil-A gift card for $50, $50 worth of Chick-fil-A, i.e. $50 worth of iced tea. The last thing that was in my stocking, I have been wanting forever and have not been able to find anywhere. That is a pair of flat cross earrings. Um, cause I just kind of wanted to like, I don't know. I really may have to like re-pierce these bottom holes. Like, well, the very bottom ones are still okay, but like my secondary ones, cause I kind of just wanted to put these crosses in all the time and, um, wear them. I thought this was kind of funny because I'm probably like the last person on earth to get one of these, but my parents got me a Bluetooth <laughs> hands-free headset. Um, but this is going to be for me to use when I'm at my screen printing studio because like it's hard to print shirts and talk on your phone and I've never had one of these before. So now I can like have this and like be on the phone while I'm working because that is so profesh. Other thing I got was a new pair of Skull Candy headphones. Um, I have the Lady Gaga ones right now, but they're kind of like crapping out on me. So what's up with that? So I needed some new just like little um, headphones. Next cool thing I got is a set of two purpley, you know, the color is probably not coming through. Um, like purpley lavender, like see the back one's like a darker purple and the, and the front one is a lighter purple. This is like a true lavender one, but they're um, Moleskine ruled notebooks. I'm always wanting to write on the go and these are like so lightweight I can just throw them in my purse because I like to write poetry or just like short stories that I think up that I never like actually sit down and do to fruition but I still just like to waste my time with writing random stuff. I actually kind of like co-authored a short story with my ex-boyfriend last night and 
yeah, I don't know if either of us is ever going to finish it though, but it sounds really good in the five and a half paragraphs that we wrote last night. Don't forget my Chick-fil-A calendar because this has coupons in it, okay? It combines my love for Chick-fil-A and extreme couponing that I can never learn, but I'll get there one day. I got this game for Christmas. It is the Trivial Pursuit Classic Rock Edition. I don't know, I love like Trivial Pursuit, like the classic classic version, like ye old Trivial Pursuit. So this combines Trivial Pursuit and Classic Rock, which I know a decent amount about. All these gifts came from my parents, so I don't know why I keep just being like my parents. Um, yeah, so they got me a laptop cooling thing. I just hit myself in the face with this. But it plugs in USB and it's just a little like lap tray. But every single time that I'm like uploading the footage into my computer, my MacBook like burns, literally burns my legs. So I'm hoping tonight when I upload this footage that I can use this cooling thing and then not have a three degree burn on my, on my lap. Then they got me this little like travel set of Estee Lauder perfumes. I love Estee Lauder perfumes. I've actually never tried sensu sen Sensuous Nude. That's so awkward, I can't even say it. Um, I've never tried that fragrance, but I love Pleasures and Beautiful is one of my favorite fragrances. And they came with this little like red clutch thing. So that's pretty cute. It's like, you know, little gift set. This is one of my favorite presents that I got this Christmas, no joke. They bought me a small Vornado heater slash fan combo. They bought this to save me from using my hairdryer and like killing myself. Um, it's got like a little sensor so I absolutely cannot die with with using this because if it like would to start to tip over it would turn itself off. But it has like two fan heat, one fan heat, or if you leave it in the middle and turn it on, it's like a regular like cooling fan. So that's really convenient for my life. It is so wonderful. It's like warm, warm waves of heaven. The other thing that I got for Christmas is I went shopping today with my family and I went to Forever 21 and got some stuff. Um, but I'm gonna make a separate like haul video for that. Um, if anyone cares, I don't know. I care so I feel like I'm gonna do it. So that is what I did today and I met two of my subscribers there which was really awesome except for I literally look like a trash basket friend today. I'm wearing my freaking um Operation Desert Storm t-shirt and like my hair my hair makes dolphins cry. Mm. So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Like 276 of you requested that I do this video on Facebook. Um, but I hope you all had a Merry Christmas and I hope nobody thinks I'm like bragging in this video. Like that's just stupid. I mean, I'm just like showing, showing everyone what I got. So as usual, please take a moment to subscribe and also like welcome to all the new people that are on my channel um, who got sent here from a Rose 186 Um, yeah. Hi. Glad to have you here. If you want, leave me a comment down below or you can feel free to video response to your Christmas haul because I'd love to see what you guys have got. I'm gonna go watch some more um, Christmas haul videos now. If you want, you can like me on Facebook, facebook.com slash graveyard girl. And last but not least, you can follow me on Twitter. And like the other day, I think it was Christmas Eve, I decided to officially change my Twitter over to graveyard girl. So now you can tweet me here at graveyard girl, um, which is spelt the same way it is here. Uh, so yeah, I hope to see all you guys on my Twitter because I'm there like all the dang time. It's an app on my phone. So I just like compulsively check Twitter. I'm like, what's new? What's new? Like I get all my news via Twitter and ancient aliens. I've killed the alien joke now. I've just, I've just overdone it. Um, okay. Bye guys.